Okay guys, this is going to be a quick off the cuff video using the Pico 4 and I've not covered this on the channels yet. I've mentioned it briefly in a, in a previous video with the, the racing setup. You can do HDMI output by Pico 4's um, USB port. So if you have a USB dock, which I've got over here, I will explain this as just a simple extension cable. That's female, male, so I'm not having to put this near the headset, um, which means I can actually move around and play within the confines of the length of the cable. So if you've got a dock with a HDMI output, you can output what you see from the headset in real time. And obviously if that's going to HDMI TV, you've got sound as well. In this case, you can tell that's not obviously a HDMI de cable device. This is an old ass CRT monitor, but I can still get a picture through because this dock has a VGA port, which ironically is not proper VGA, it's using HDMI standard, but that works perfect in this case because it's basically treating this like two displays. So I've also got this HDMI port in there. And this is the really cool part here, is not only can I have this screen going, but I can have a completely different screen at the same time as well. So if you've got a setup where you want to use this as a social sort of party thing, you can actually have a screen in a different room. You don't need to be tied into the same room you're in. Um, or even if you just want a two display thing, you can do whatever you want. But in a social setup, that's actually pretty cool. You can just extend the HDMI cable to a different screen. Say you've got this setup in your living room. You've got the TV that's displaying for the people that are in the living room. But you've also got something in the kitchen if you want to go in there and sort of, if you are in a social gathering, um, you want to keep an eye on what's happening for the person playing. And this obviously is just mirror image of what the person's seeing. So in the Pico, even the pass throughs recorded here. Um, there's no casting, I'm not on the internet, I'm, I'm way up in my shed. No internet, no Wi-Fi here. It's all going through that USB-C connection. Um, and again, if you've got a dock set up like this, I'm using a two meter extension heat here. I don't know how far you can possibly push that before it starts um, giving you a problem. But this two meter one's working and this dock that I've shown in the last video, I've got the, the PD charge so I can actually charge the headset while this is doing it. And I can even plug in a USB device if I really wanted to. And I've also now got the option of using two displays at the same time. And that was about 15 pound on Amazon. It's literally just a basic, basic USB-C type dock. Um, yeah, super simple thing to, to do. Again, I've not done any setup in the headset. I've just plugged the cable into the headset. Um, and it's, it's working. So I'm really happy with this. Um, there's loads of stupid stuff you can do in Pico. I'm still figuring it out myself, but I thought I'd share this video. And uh, if anyone's got any use case that they can make of this, you can do it. It's, it's super simple. So cheers, guys.